Hi everybody, today I'm going to show you how to make a raspberry coolie or raspberry sauce. So it's a very simple sauce. Um, I've already got my ingredients already in my pot. So I've got, I'm using frozen raspberries today. You can use fresh raspberries. Um, it's just cheaper to use frozen at the moment. That's why I've got frozen. So I've got 450 um, grams of frozen raspberries. I've also then got eight tablespoons of caster sugar. I've then also put in um, half a, one quarter of a teaspoon of salt, a quarter of a cup of water, and then I've also got one teaspoon um, of lemon juice um, as well. So you can put a bit more lemon juice in if you want to. Um, it's just up to you. So you can put it with a teaspoon or you can even put a tablespoon in there as well. Okay, so as I said, I've got my ingredients in my saucepan here. Um, I've then put my hot plate on. So I'm just going to mix this in over the heat just so the sugar is going to be dissolved. And then I'm not going to bring this to the boil. Um, I'm just going to simmer, have this simmering. I'm just going to mix this in. finished with cooking the sauce on the hot plate so when it looks like this so you've all the sugars melted we didn't bring it to the boil we just bring it to a simmer and it's, all the berries are broken up in there you now basically it's done so now all you have to do now is get a stick blender put it on high So once that's done, look, you can serve it like this, but what I like to do is I get, actually get rid of the seeds because it's not really nice um, for your guests to actually taste the seeds. Unless, like you while I said, it depends. But what I usually do now is I'm simply just going to go to a bowl here with a strainer. You're going to put your mixture into the strainer simply the sauce. So that's really good. 
So there you have it. That's my raspberry sauce, raspberry coolie. It look, it makes quite a lot. So I've made this much with this. This is it's it is a little bit strong. Um, so you know it depends if you, when you're adding to like a chocolate tart or to ice cream, you can put as much or as little as you want. Um, you can add if you want more sour, you can add more lemon to it as well. Um, you just keep it in the fridge. Um, but yeah, you can use it for a lot of desserts. Um, you can use it as a cheesecake. Um, I don't want to make a, like a raspberry or strawberry cheesecake. I actually make this first to actually put it into the cheesecake. So it's really, really good. So thank you for subscribing. Thank you for liking and sharing in your comments. And I'll see you next time. If you have any other, if you have something you actually want me to make, I'll just let me know um, and I will make it for you. So um, if not, I'll see you next time. Okay, bye.